Today, we're going to be answering life's biggest question. Can we actually tell if someone is gay or not? Now, even if we could, that shouldn't really matter because we don't judge, especially not on the Solomax channel. Like and subscribe. You can be attracted to whoever you want to be, uh, except kids uh, and animals. But anything other than that, free game. I think. So yeah, honestly, it doesn't matter if we can figure out if someone is gay or not. But uh, we're gonna test it out anyway. With Jubilee! Round of applause for Jubilee! Way! Jubilee! 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 Just something. What is Jubilee doing now? Men rank themselves by penile size. Wait, how does that work? Do they just flop their dick on the table and then the other guys is just gonna be like, mm, yeah, definitely an A tier right there. Almost wanna watch that but, that, but that's not what we're doing today. We're watching- What's up, good human? Six straight men. Versus one secret gay man. Oh my god. Yes, I know everyone has reacted to this video, I think. But I've deliberately avoided this specific video just in case uh, there was a time where I didn't have uh, time to record anything else. What can I say? I'm a busy guy. You are a child. Shut up. Now, in case you don't know how this works. So we brought together seven straight men. I am a straight man. I'm straight. I am a straight man. I'm straight. I am a straight man. I'm straight. I am a straight man. One is a liar. If the group discovers who the liar is, they'll split a cash prize. If the liar survives, he or she wins the entire prize. And there you go, let's watch. Straight. I'm not gonna sit I here and just straight. judge I'm people straight. based on their looks, he's gay. All right, he, th that guy straight. looks pretty straight. I'm straight. That guy too. I am a straight. That guy too. I'm straight. Mm, he has a little smirk. He could be lying. I am a uh, I'll, I'll, I'll come back to you. I'm straight. He looks like he's married with kids. But is he married to a man or a woman? That's the question. I'm a straight man. Uh, yeah, you look straight. Are you sexually attracted to men? Uh, absolutely. Fuck! No, but, uh, I can appreciate a good man. Good answer. That's a good answer right there. Listen, if you're someone who knows he's straight and is very comfortable with being straight, you're, you, you can appreciate a good man. And if you can't, you're gay. You're gay. You gotta be able to say, hey, that man looks fucking fine. I mean, take Brad Pitt, for example. Look at that man. That's a good looking man right there. Like, I'm not gay, but even I can say that's a good looking man. Seven, Fight Club, Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. Bullet Train, all great movies where he looks mm, stunning. So yeah, obviously you can appreciate a good-looking man. I, I respect Corbin for saying that. By the way, I'm not gay. Okay, that makes sense. Uh, you you have a wedding ring? I do. When did you get married? Oh shit, I was right. He is married. <laughs> okay, all right. All right. What's your wife's name? Stephanie. Ooh. Stephanie. Do we believe that? He was confident with that. It was like he had that answer ready when he was on his car ride on, on his way here. That's like a very common woman's name. I would have believed him more if he, he went out and says like Shashmin or something like that. Who here has kissed a dude or been kissed by a dude? Oh, I've absolutely. Been kissed by a dude. I've kissed yes. a dude. Yes! Yeah! Who here has Wait, kissed what? a dude and liked it? Hold up. Something wrong yeah, with yeah, him. Yeah. Oh, not anymore. Sorry. I accidentally kissed my best friend on my birthday. One of my How the hell do you accidentally kiss your best friend? <laughs> How do you do that? Did you just run into him being like, oh shit, sorry, didn't see you there. Uh. It was an accident. It was? <laughs> yeah, oh. it, it was really funny. My girlfriend was there, she saw it. Glad we got a lot of accomplishments. <laughs> My girlfriend, I have a girlfriend, guys. Who, who knows who won the Super Bowl? What? I don't fucking know, I'm not American. Ah, oh, they're all going after Corbin. I was the mole, but when it came down to it, I was like, I gotta play for strategy, I gotta win. Yeah, fair, fair. Ah, oh, damn, Corbin. Oh. Ah, uh, person you asked a question to. <laughs> That's what happens in all of these episodes. Is the only person they ask a question to is the one that gets voted out. That is true. By the way, do you have a key as a necklace? What the hell? What? What does that mean? Has anyone here been mistaken for a gay person? Yes. And Always. why do you? I probably have, honestly. No one has really told me, but they're probably thinking it's... <laughs> I mean, it might be, I don't know, I, I speak with like a California accent, I guess, maybe. I say like a lot. I get mistaken for... Does that make you gay? If you say like a lot? So like, if you say like, like a lot, you're gay, all right. I'm being gay all the time, what? which is why I don't right. think... You learn like something new every day. How could you identify a person by their physical appearance, whether they're gay or not? I don't Suspicious. It's, it sounds like you're trying to... But drag the attention away from what you're wearing. I think that's possible, and that's the conversation I tried to start, which was shut down pretty quickly. I feel like for this to be effective, we have to put mm. everyone I'm suspicious kind of, of him. in the spot, and like, and then everyone else just analyzes them. <laughs> Ask what? me questions. Wait, wait, look at my eyes real quick. Are you gay? No. <laughs> what? Look at my eyes real quick. Are you gay? No. <laughs> The fuck did he expect from that? Okay, this, this is that was hard. <laughs> what did he expect? Are you gay? No. Are you gay? No. Are you gay? No. Are you gay? Yes. Ah, damn it. Because it can't just be because it yeah. can't just be like oh everyone gangs up on one person because like then the gay person has a chance to like hide in the shadows or like hide in the noise, you know.
Do you think the gay person is like a ninja or something? Hide in the shadows! What the hell is this guy on? I don't think he's gay. He's just very weird. Everyone with your strategy. eyes, with your eyes, just look at Jonathan. Okay. <laughs> it was... If what? What is that? What is that strategy? What do they expect? Did they, did they expect Jonathan to be like, oh, a lot of guys looking at me. Guys, stop. If they're gay, they're gonna act different. Uh, no. <laughs> Have you ever seen a penis? I've seen multiple penises. Yeah. Who, who hasn't seen a penis? What? How, how did you feel about them? Uh, I, <laughs> I felt good about them. Damn. I wasn't sexually attracted to any of them. <laughs> but, like, here's the thing. <laughs> it's, uh, suspicious. Uh, that guy just keeps asking straight out, like, are you gay? Uh, I, I respect it. How do you meet and date now? I'm kind of like just committing to like season of singleness, you know? Okay, nice. Ah, good, job. good job. Yeah, See, I respect well, that. Me too. When was your first girlfriend? My first one was probably... Me too. Like, I was, I'm also single. That's... I, I could obviously get a girlfriend if I wanted. <laughs> See, my thing is... I should probably back up. I'm, I'm like Muslim. So my thing is like, it's just... Dating is just usually very unconventional and it's like very like limited. Yeah. So, I mean... Is that a thing in Muslim culture to be gay? Um, and... I feel like as far as like religion goes, I, I mean, usually isn't it a thing where it's... Wait, so he's Muslim, and it's not, and because he's Muslim, it's not really accepted as much to be gay. Is that what he's saying? I should probably hear what he has to say, because I don't really get it. Like, gay are, you, aren't really... are you pretty devout? I would say... Because even if you are Muslim, and it's not accepted to be gay, you can still be gay. It, does, it doesn't automatically take away the ability to be gay. Like me personally, I'm not gay. Please, please believe me. Um, but... E even I know that being gay is not really much of a choice. It's a very, like, don't ask, don't tell. It's something that needs to be addressed. There should be a lot of love <laughs> coming out, just in general, you know? Very true, but it just seems like the ultimate trump card or something like that. How's your relationship with your dad? It's fine. <laughs> Play baseball. What? Sick. Why is that a question? How's your relationship with your dad? So if they said, eh, not very good, you're gay then. Last person. Open book. Come on. Uh... Give it to me, Jonathan. Do you shave your butt? <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, he even gave them time to think of a fucking question and that's it. Have you kissed a dude? He said he did. I, I have. I'm gonna be honest, I haven't actually kissed a dude, but I was very, very close to it. I was very close to it. it, it I hadn't kissed anyone, right? And then I got dared to kiss a dude. And, and I was like, I mean, it was a dare and I asked for the dare, so I guess I gotta do it. And then I was leaning in. Almost got, <laughs> I was this close to getting like, a, to kissing a dude, but right before I just remember, oh shit, I have never kissed anyone and I, and my first kiss is gonna be with a guy and I just fucking pushed that asshole away. So I almost did it. If I had, if I had kissed someone before that, I would have kissed a dude. What was the... And I would have been proud, goddammit. I don't want to say no, I'm gonna be honest. I kissed the guy because I was like, I could be bi and then turns out I wasn't. Damn it! now I'm not suspicious of him. He seemed, that, that seems very, you know, uh, uh, yeah, that, that seems like a very, uh, uh, true thing to say. Jason, uh... Yeah, I think Corbin was right with, uh, the person that gets asked the most questions is the one they, that goes out. Rest in peace, Jason. Raise your hand if you think the mole is still in the square and you... I think so. I don't think Corbin or Jason is the mole. But I can't, I can't say who it is. Like they all look kind of straight. He has very casual clothes on. It feels like he, he put that on just to look the least gay. Calling out his so I'm, I'm also suspicious, suspicious so of him. Like bad and I apologize. That guy is 100% straight. I, I, I know calling out is so like bad and I apologize, but it's a game, it's a game. You just say... I think you're gay, right? Ah, uh, And so this is what think I think. Is. This is, there's a lot of dominating the conversation, the body language, and trying to control everything. I thought he was... Yeah, but like, yeah, that, that is a valid strategy, <laughs> but... Dominating but the conversation, not to judge. the body language. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. No, <laughs> no fucking way he has the capabilities to use that strategy and, and get away with it. <laughs> Especially not when he asked the question, do you shave your butt to figure out if someone was gay or not? And he just, he just continuously asked straight out, hey, are you gay? Just, just, just tell me. Just please tell me. I thought he was acting maybe too macho. Okay, maybe he is over on his right. No, he's just very confused. I'm going to look at Wesley, look at the tattoo on his right arm. Right. Those are three stakes. Yeah. What does that represent? The crucifixion. All right. right. Oh, he's I Christian. I don't necessarily believe he's gay. I've met a lot of gay I, I know, Christians. I've met a lot I mean, of because he's So because he's Christian, he's probably not gay. I mean, it's not a, 
It's definitely not a get out of jail free card, but it's definitely a clue to him not being gay. What really sucks about this, guys, is we became friends, and now I feel like we're not. We're not. So, like, after yeah, this is over, right. can we still get beers? Yes, yeah. I want to get beers. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Okay. Hey, the wait, boys. <laughs> it's a date then after, right? <laughs> I mean, obviously, who wouldn't want a date with the boys? If you want to. The one thing I'll say, I'm chill if you, if you guys put me off. All right, let's do that then. I'm I what a fucking legend. <laughs> Yeah, I'm fine with not getting the money. You can vote me off, it's fine. How many times has what a king. your gaydar been right in real life? I don't believe in that kind of a thing. Oh, so gaydar? Oh, like if you can see if someone is gay or not. Uh, yeah, that's where, that's been right like 0% of the time. But my straightar has been kind of good. <laughs> Does that exist? <laughs> straightar? Like, that guy, I will, I can bet you a thousand dollars he's straight. And the Asian guy is straight as well. I forgot his name. I think we spent the first four minutes just discussing how we were gonna approach finding out who's gay. And I'm like, dude, we need to do the dang- Did, did you not think of that before? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking these guys, bro. What's the gayest thing about you all? Dude, honestly- <laughs> Oh, shit. I don't know. Me and my friends literally just like poked our fingers up each other's butts. <laughs> what the <laughs> what? Like, what? Like, hey, no, fuck. Really? Hey, I mean, dude, no, dude, bro, what like, happened? Dude, it's so gay. Like, take no, two no, fingers think about it or something? No, no, let me explain. Let me, it's so gay <laughs> that it's true. <laughs> it's so gay. <laughs> It's so gay that it's straight. It's, it's stick a finger up someone's ass. It, it's that that's that's pretty straight. I'm Korean, and there's this thing called dongchim where it's like horseplay or whatever to like come up behind one of your friends and like stick your like finger up their butt like this and yell like dongchim. Oh, I have actually done that. I did I did that to my friend once. <laughs> so yes, that is actually so gay that it's straight. Basically, my friend was getting a piggyback ride, and it was a golden opportunity. Like, his ass was out. And uh, so I took my fingers like this and shaved them like, uh, you know, a James Bond gun, uh, just like he's doing here. Went up behind him and just, voo, right up to, uh, right up the pants, covering up the sacred place. And uh, I swear, I have never heard my friend scream that loud. He probably screamed so loud the Antarctic wolves howled back to him or something like that. It was, it was, I have never heard him scream so loud and it was fucking hilarious, but I probably should have expected it to come and uh, bite me in the ass later on or stick a finger up my ass to be more precise. Uh, because like two days later or something like that, he did the same thing to me and I probably screamed even louder than him. Probably screamed so loud it would make a professional female opera singer jealous or something like that. I thought it was funny, but I was with him. Yeah, the, yeah, like, I, I, I am too, yeah. <laughs> okay, I hear you. I don't think you're it. What's the gayest thing that you do? No fucking way this guy's gay. You're pretty friendly? That's Is true. that considered gay? Because that's gay happiness. Like, people might be like, yo, that dude's a little too happy. I'm like, yeah, I am. That's a good... <laughs> I think the gayest thing that I do... I don't even know what he said. I didn't understand a word of that. If you do gay stuff, like... You're cool. You're probably not gay. <laughs> <laughs> I agree, but that could have been said so much better. What he's trying to say is, if you're someone who's straight and know you're straight, you're more likely to do something more gay than a gay person would. Like, a straight person would be more likely to kiss the homies goodnight than a gay person would, for example. <laughs> uh, I, see, um, I think the gay, the gay thing about me, honestly, would probably be like my... Just like taste in music, you know, I'm like a Beyonce fan. I've been listening to like Britney Spears. I respect the fuck out of that. That's that's my thing. I guess. I'm not personally into that, but I have jammed out to Ariana Grande a few times and I'm not afraid to say it. Wait, like, wait is it cool if I do ask you just yeah, no, about go like ahead. homosexuality and like the like the Muslim community? Yeah, yeah, that's fine. I feel like a lot of religious organizations kind of take that conservative approach where they're like, okay, you know, just uh, everybody's allowed in the religion, but you know, you can't really. So if you were, would you be comfortable like coming out? Would I be? Yeah, probably not. Just. I'm being honest for a But that could still make you gay. But I guess if you haven't come out, no one would know you're gay. So you can, you're technically still straight in the eyes of others. This is so confusing. I don't think he's gay. Simply because he's using that card so much. I feel like if he was gay, he would probably refrain from using that all the time. Because it is a, it is a power move, saying that. Even when he was asked the question, he didn't really talk much. He gave like a really quick answer and was like, on to the next person. But that guy, this guy. I don't, I don't think he's gay, but he, I haven't heard a lot from him, so I can't, I can't really say. He could, he could, I wouldn't be surprised. Wesley and Evan. I don't like this game anymore, can I? I don't know who the hell it is. They all, they are, they are all so straight to me. Rest in peace, Evan. I think Evan is more likely to be gay than Wesley is. Again, I'm putting yeah. myself out there again, like probably like yeah, a shopping no, block. I still think that Wes is the mole. No, he's not. I, I swear to God, he's not. That, okay, that, that, that works. I, this that's is fine. where I'm thinking. All right. Because and, and saying then, I'm Muslim 
is yeah. like the ultimate trump card of saying like, yeah yeah and, no and, I, I get that i totally get that so in, in this thank game, god he said that be a liar and i was like that is such a strong play yeah to I said use. That. it's either absolute truth or it's absolutely a lie because yep. he threw out the muslim card i don't want to be controversial so therefore <laughs> what <laughs> don't you don't want to be controversial bro are you we guys can, gay? No, but we can. <laughs> please, please, just tell me. Hey, be, hey, we're homies here. Come on. <laughs> He's just giving up. He's like, I, tell me, please, please, I can't do this anymore. Yeah, I expected that. There you go. That's, that's the, that was the strategy, right? Yeah. Yeah. There you go. To be honest, I, I was surprised I made it as far as I did in the game. I feel like I played that hand really strong, and I was just like, you know what? Yeah. I'm a Muslim, it can't be me. I mean, if, if he was gay, I don't think he would have played it that strongly, as he said. He would have probably been like, oh, I'm, I'm using this excuse way too many times, let's stop here. Raise your hand if you would like to continue the game. Can we talk about this for one second? Come on, continue the game, dude. Continue the game. No, I think, it, uh, Jared, I think they're continue up. continue the game. Continue dude, the game! I, I... Dude. Dude, I, I want the money because I'm competitive. No, 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 I think it's out. But I think the mole's out. Yeah. Red, the mole is still in the square. Yeah. Green, come on. Green. Go on. Have voted the Green. Out. I will feel so betrayed if it's red. We won. No, we won. We won, you think? We won. I, think I think, yeah, they, I think they won. We won. Yes! Oh! Yes! <laughs> Yes! Oh my god! Thank god! Oh, Damn, that was tense. I really wanted them to win. Hey, who's the mole? Wait. Yeah, okay. Who's the mole? Who's the mole? Uh, I, I think it's the it's the guy with the tucked in shirt. Yeah, not not this guy. Like, come on, he's 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 straighter than straight. But uh, the I forgot his name, but he he had a tucked in shirt. Uh, Asian, I think. Yeah, he was Asian. That guy. I think it's him. Oh shit! Dude. That was right, dude. What? I was shocked. I thought it was West the entire time. I'm happy. No fucking way. He's the gay one. Oh my god, now he looks gay. <laughs> I got it right away. And there are some like Wes had no idea. Yeah, obviously Wes had no idea about anything. Was <laughs> this is this is bullying. I'm sorry. I never a point where I thought Evan was the more. Oh, no, <laughs> no, I like Wesley. He was my favorite character in this. I hope that people take away the fact that people are more than just their sexuality. I think that's the root of everything. Any that's goddamn right. Well said, Evan. Mwah, beautiful. Happy Pride Month, everyone. Whether you're LGBTQ or straight or anything else, I dislike everyone equally. Except if you're subscribed to the Solomax channel, then I like you a bit more. <laughs> I like how no one, no one ever suspected Jared. Like he just, he, he just oozes the word straight. There's not really anything to go off of for this guy. Alright, that's it. This video was not what it was supposed to be, but I was actually supposed to play a game, but I've been way too busy being lazy, so to compensate for this shit post, I will hopefully have a new video out very, very soon. Hopefully. <laughs> and no, it's not Bloodborne. Please don't cry. We'll come back to that. Have patience. Don't worry. Okay, thanks. Thank you. I've actually been kind of busy going to uh, the last remaining exams and uh, finishing off school and stuff like that. So I haven't had the time to record anything other than this video right here. Um, but summer vacation has started for me, so I have all the time in the world to uh, pop out videos all the time. Yay! Anyway, that's it. What did we learn? Fuck all, but I still hope you enjoyed. So uh, I will be back with a new video, hopefully very, very soon, sooner than normal. So uh, stay tuned for that. And I apologize for whatever the fuck this was. But uh, see you next time. Bye.